wonderful people, how are you guys doing today? I hope you guys are doing amazing! My name is Bianca, you can call me B, and welcome back to Books with B! Today, right now, in this video, I just wanted to do a vlog, um, just to... I guess document my flight and like me going away and like me moving to a different country so I thought this would be the perfect opportunity to do a reading vlog with me leaving if does that, does that make sense? Like, I wanted to document my move to Australia and also just wanted to read while doing that so that I can be a little distracted, you know? Because it's gonna be a very sad day when I leave because, again, I will miss my dog and I will miss my family and my friends, obviously, but mostly my dog. <laughs> But yeah, I just, I just, I just, I guess I just wanted to document it, um, to see on like what I will do each day before my flight, and yeah, I'm just a little sad. But you know, new opportunities lay out there, and I will try my best to smile. A fair warning, you might see a little crying in this video. I'm not still sure, cause I'm still, you know, right here. But you might see some cryings. You might have seen them in the intro already, but I'm not 100% sure, but yeah. So I wanted to do the 50 pages a day challenge, so we will get through this. Um, so it will be like, it will be in a span of a week. So right now, it is Wednesday, and I will end the challenge next Wednesday, and it will be my first day in Australia. So, let's do this. So let me like just tell you what I'm currently reading. I am currently reading Normal People by Sally Rooney and I'm actually really liking it. I am halfway. It's actually a really chill book. I didn't expect that I would like it, but it's a really great book. Like I know I get I get the hype. And the other one that I'm reading is Bridge to Terabithia by Katherine Patterson. I love the movie of this one and I want to finish it as soon as I can because I know this is a book where I'm gonna cry or a lot of people have cried and I don't want to add sadness to my life right now because I know I'm gonna be sad in a couple of days. So I might just want to finish this as soon as I can. And the next current read that I have is Loki Agent of Asgard. I actually haven't been reading this as much as I wanted to so right now I just want to I guess force myself into reading this. And it's not cheating if I'm reading a comic, even though it's 50 pages a day, it's not cheating because graphic novels, comic books are still books. So, <laughs> I'm actually really excited for this one. Yeah, it's actually a thick comic book, so I just really want to finish this real soon as well because it is heavy and I kind of don't want to bring it in Australia because I... I already have a lot of books that I want to bring. So those are the books that I might get into. I will start today. It's, it's actually Wednesday night. So I will start today. And since it's nighttime, I kind of don't want to pressure myself. So I will start with Loki and finish at the 50 page mark. Hold on. They don't have pages. Do I have to manually count this? Oh my god, this comic doesn't have pages. Sorry. I guess have to, I, I guess I just have to manually count it, but I will probably finish more than 50 pages tonight, hopefully, and I will update you guys every day. So let's go! I will update you tomorrow. Hello, so it is the next night update. So yesterday night, I read around 100 pages of Loki. And this morning, I read around 72 pages more of Loki. Um, so today was pretty busy. I had a haircut. If you 
<laughs> if you noticed. Anyway, let's talk about that later. So I went to the dentist and I had a haircut. Just because I know things like that in Australia can be very expensive compared to here. So I just did those things. So you did see a clip of me reading normal people while I was waiting in the dentist but I didn't really wait that long so I think I only read like a page so I'm not really gonna count that but right now I'm enjoying Loki so much I mean it's confusing it's it's getting a little confusing because there's a lot of Lokis that we are dealing with there's old Loki and then there's this new resurrected Loki it's just a lot but I'm really having fun with it Obviously, it's more of like Asgard parts of the Marvel comics, and I'm loving it so far. Right now, I don't know if it's in the blurb, but it, it is in the blurb. So, right now we follow the new resurrected Loki, where he he does missions for the All Mothers, which is Freya and the other Asgardian mothers, and he's just basically sort of their lap dog but he obviously he's loki so he doesn't want to be so he still has like a lot of mischief to do that's just about it um so i cut my hair i just want to say this is a sign if you love your hair don't cut it <laughs> okay the reason why i cut it is because in australia the haircuts range around thirty to fifty dollars, and I do not have the money to have to have my hair done for that amount. But obviously, I loved my wolf cut, right? So I told the hairdresser I wanted a wolf cut, but make it a little shorter. I don't know. Right now, it's looking okay because I'm t I tied it, but I don't even know if it's if it looks okay if it's untied. I'm still ah, <laughs> I don't know. It looks so bad, but. A lot of my friends and my f mom and my family are saying it's okay. Uh, but I don't know how to feel about this new hair. Whatever, it's gonna grow out. <laughs> it's so messy. But I don't know, we'll see. If I don't like it, I'll just do an updo look like how I did it a while ago. We'll see. I don't know, but this is a ride. This vlog is gonna... <laughs> it's just the second day. And I feel freaking stressed already. Uh, I haven't packed. I am gonna pack my whole life and I haven't packed. And my flight is in, what, four days. Good luck to me. <laughs> so, anyway, yeah. Uh, tomorrow I will try my best to read probably normal people. I really want to finish that really soon. And Bridge to Terabithia. I really want to finish that really soon too but since I have been overwhelmed with a lot of stuff I just have Loki if I want to just rest and chill I don't have any plans tomorrow anyway I might be meeting a friend but that's about it so I will probably edit a lot of videos and yeah We'll see. I hope I get time to read. I will try my best to read in the morning and then at night. But right now, this challenge, I am... <laughs> it's not cheating, okay? Comic books are books. But I am knocking it off the park with this challenge. Technically, because right now, I am around 170 pages in and it's just the second day. So... I'm just being crafty, you know? It's I'm not cheating, it's, you know, I'm just being very smart about it. I'm playing smart, not playing hard. Um, so yeah, I will update you guys again the next day, and I will try my best to read a novel. So, I'll see you.
I'm sad to say that I do not have an update. I don't know why I tired myself out today. Uh, but my brother and I watched Morbius, uh, the vampire Marvel Sony movie, and I don't really want to talk about it. <laughs> It's not the best Marvel movie in the world! Whatever, anyway, I had didn't read today, which I already, like, technically, I, I just, I didn't, you know, technically, I failed this challenge already, but, but, in total, I've read 172 pages, so, this is the third day, so I should have read 150 pages already. I have exceeded it. So, I'm still in the running. I don't care. I'm gonna make my own rules. I'm just very tired today. So, I'm really sorry I didn't read today. Uh, I will try my best to read tomorrow. Though, my friends and I will go bowling. I have no idea how long, but we'll see if I can. I'm still very hopeful that I can do this challenge. So, we will see. And this is my first day with my new hair. My first full day with my new hair. And... I'm still not loving it. I feel like a boy. Which is, there's nothing wrong about that. But like, I, whatever, it'll grow. I mean, I'm not that kind of person. I mean, it will grow. My hair grows fast anyway. So I will just have it back as the way I used to before I cut it like this. Again, this is another sign that if you want to cut your hair... Even though you love your hair, please don't. <laughs> uh, anyway, I will check up on you guys tomorrow. Hello! Reading update! I started reading Bridge of Terabithia. I started reading this around like two days ago. And so now I'm just uh, reading where I left off, which was page 38. And now I am in page 100. So again, that is more than 50. So I think I did a good job. And I think before I go to bed, I'm going to finish this because it is a thin book and it is a children's book. So it's easy to digest and read. And the fonts are really big. And I just really wanted to finish this already. But that's for my reading update. For my moving update, I have started to pack, but I didn't really pack a lot. Uh, my mom's helping me. We're packing the things that I need. So I have my journal stuff, my electronics, but I haven't packed like 
clothing because <laughs> it's so hard also so today you saw from the clips it was so fun today um so i spent my day with my childhood best friends and we went bowling and my brother was there obviously he was there uh and we bought new keycaps um if you don't know i recently gained an obsession with keyboards and now I'm very satisfied. Uh, when I discovered my love for keyboards, all I wanted to have was sort of a TVA sort of theme when it comes to my keyboards, like retro um, TVA, if you don't know, TVA from Loki. Um, so the orange retro theme, and I freaking love it. These are expensive though. The keycaps are freaking expensive. These are Echo keycaps, and I'm in love with them. Um, also, I bought the this Artisan keycap that kind of looks like Luna. There, that's what she looks like when she was a puppy, so I had to buy it because I know I will miss her so much. I don't want to cry on camera, but holy crap. I'm sorry. I'm so 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 sorry. It's just every time I... Every time. Whew, every time I imagine I won't see her in the morning. It just makes me cry anyway. I don't want to cry on camera, but I guess this is part of the moving vlog because I will be crying a lot when days are nearing. I'm sorry. Okay. Whew. I'm sorry. I was so, so, so super, super happy that my brother and I had sort of a sibling bonding day. Uh, we both changed our keycaps over keyboards and we went to archery and bowling with our friends. And I don't know, I just loved today. And plus, <laughs> I did my goal of 50 pages, which I didn't achieve yesterday, <laughs> but I'm just very happy, I guess. Um, so tomorrow, what I have planned is I'm just going to have lunch with my family, and we plan on having this family photo shoot that we do. Um, we did that when I first left for Australia, and now since I'm leaving again, we're planning to do that, but now with the dogs, and I cannot wait to see how Luna and I will look in like in a professional photo shoot setting. We don't usually do this, it's just when I'm leaving, we do it because I wanted to, especially now that we have Luna, I just wanted to have a professional taken photo with my dog that I can put in my wallet. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm crying again. Anyway, I'm sorry. <laughs> Ew, I don't like me crying. Anyway, ho. Oh, um, I will continue reading The Bridge, Bridge to Clarabithia. I might <laughs> be crying because of the story of this as well. I know how it ends. I watched the movie. That is actually the first time I had <laughs> A celebrity crush because Josh Hutcherson was starring Bridget Therabithia and I was sort of the same age as he was when I watched it so I know how this ends and yeah I just want to see if I'm gonna cry but I feel like I'm gonna cry more because of Luna because there's a dog in this book ha <sighs> I'm sorry if I cried too much in this clip but I will update you guys tomorrow uh, hopefully by tomorrow I'm gonna finish Bridge to Therabithia to Terabithia. Um, so as of now, I read on the first day I read 98 pages. On the second day I read 72 pages, and on the third day I read nothing. <laughs> and today is the fourth day, and I read. Oh my God, I cannot math. I read. I read 62 pages. So that's a total of, again, I cannot math, um, that's a total of 232, which today is the fourth day, so I should have at least 200 pages, and now I have 232, so I'm still ahead of the challenge. Let's do this, I can do this, let's distract myself with reading so that I won't cry as much, because life right now is punching me in the gut. But yeah, I'll update you guys about tomorrow, so.
I'm sorry for not updating. Yesterday, yesterday was a little overpacked. It was jam packed. Um, my family decided to have like a getting away kind of thing, and it was fun. I loved it. I loved every minute of it. But now it's getting so real. Tomorrow is my flight. Tomorrow night. So it's just getting real, and I'm a little sad because Luna is looking sad. I'm not sure if she feels it, that I'm leaving, that I'm giving clues, I'm not sure if she's getting it, but right now she's a little sad, she's been just lying down the whole day, I don't know what's happening, I'm really sad, <laughs> but I'm excited as well, I should, I should just think about how excited I'm going to be, if I don't, I will just break down and cry. Anyway, the last update, I thought, I think I was like reading Bridge of Terabithia. I'm done with it. I finished it on the night that I said I was gonna finish it. Hooray! Um, and then now I'm halfway through Loki. You know what? I'm giving up counting the pages of Loki. I will check in Goodreads how many pages there are because they don't. Uh, comic books don't have page numbers, so I have no idea how much pages I'm reading. But as of I know, as of right now, I'm halfway with Loki, and my goal is to finish it before I leave because it is a chunky comic and it's very heavy to bring on the flight so i'm 100 percent sure that i want to finish this plus you know what i'm not really cheating on the pages because this is a very chunky comic and i feel like i'm reading a novel and since it's loki and asgard and thor and everything i feel like it's high fantasy too so i'm not cheating this is a big big book okay it's a little confusing at times but what I love about this is we see different kinds of Lokis. Um, we see it when he when he changes his gender, and I love I love Lady Loki. She's a badass. And we have future Loki as well, trying to terrorize present Loki. It's a lot of things. I just I can't describe what's happening. Um, and Amora is here too. Uh, I've read stuff about Amora, but I'm not hundred percent sure who she is yet, but I've been seeing her when I skimmed the pages. Honestly, this comic has been such a ride, and I'm not even halfway. I mean, I'm already halfway. It's good. Oh, plus, I love that in every different, like, phase, like, arc of everything, that the art changes, and I just love seeing different kinds of art. This is an example. Like, this is more realistic and stuff and then where i'm at is more cartoony more comic book -y. see yeah i don't know how to explain it um but everyone's here thor uh i hate that odin is actually somewhat of a good father here because we don't see that in the movies i wish we see that in the movies but that's what we have, and I love it. And there's this part where Odin was like, I love my children, one son and one both. I'm like, oh my god, I love that. He acknowledges Loki's um, genders, and comic book Odin is so much better than movie Odin. Anyway, so as of the moment, I have read... 389 pages and what day is it today? I think it is day five Six it's day six So I should have read 300 pages and still 
So, okay, so the math. Oh my god. <laughs> so, I should have read to for today 300 pages, but in total I have already read 389 pages. So, I'm still on track and the challenge will end tomorrow during my flight and you'll see how sad I'm going to be. But yeah. Um I s I'm still going to read Loki. I'm hoping to finish it tonight. We'll see if I can. And then so that for the flight, I will be reading a new book. Anyway, either way, I'm still on track. Actually, I think I finished a challenge. Because if it's 7 days and then 50 pages, so that's 350 pages for the week. I'm already at 380. 380, I lost it. 389, I'm done. Actually, I'm done with this challenge. <laughs> no, but I'm still going to read and hopefully read something else in the plane. So anyway, I will update you guys tomorrow or tonight. I don't know, but we will see. Tonight's my flight, and I just want to cry. No, I'm kidding. I don't want to cry. Yeah, so tonight's my flight, and I just want to hold my baby. And today's the last day of the challenge. You will probably see me read during the flight. So I think you'll see more book content there. I will probably read a new book. I haven't finished Loki. I'm sad about that. I will probably finish it before I leave, hopefully, but if not, it's fine. I can get an ebook copy. Anyway, yeah, the reason why I have her with me right now is just want to have every second with her. Luna, say hi! Mm. I love you. I love you so much. So, it's her nap time usually at this time. So I'm gonna just let her nap. I love you. Okay, I'll make you nap now. This will probably be the last time I'm gonna film in this setup. So that's a little emotional too. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just need to pack up all my stuff now. That's why I'm updating you right now. But I hope I will be able to finish Loki today. If not, it's fine. Uh, anyway, I love you guys so much. Uh, the next time I will talk to you guys, I will be in Melbourne. So, see you then.
Hi! So, I'm in Australia now. I'm holding the mic really weird. I hope it's not that bad. I didn't break my stand. But yeah, I think I'm gonna end the vlog really soon. I just wanted to like just say hi that I'm in Australia now and I did complete the challenge days before. So, yeah. Uh, so yeah, uh, I just wanted to let, let you guys see this as well. Obviously, the first thing I bought is a book. And this is such a cute cover of a picture of Dorian Gray. I'm so excited. I mean, I already read a few pages of it and I'm so hooked. I think that will be my first read here. Um, so yeah, this was fun. Uh, I'm sorry if other scenes were a little sad. I'm a little sad, but you know, this is a new opportunity and a new way to just, you know, live. And I'm very grateful for this opportunity and I hope I will get to film more stuff. But right now, I will probably upload a lot of stuff that's pre-filmed from my room in the Philippines. Because I will probably be overwhelmed with a lot of things. But hopefully this vlog will be up really soon. But yeah. So thank you so much for watching. If you're still here, you're a freaking champ. I'm so sorry that this vlog kind of more kind of became more of a moving vlog than a reading vlog. But I hope you guys still enjoyed that. This is part of my journey. So I guess you'll see that as well. If you're still here, you're a freaking champ. Have an amazing, amazing rest of your day. And I will see you in next one. Mwah. Bye!